Okay, so um, I said things would be a bit different on my last video, and um, yeah, I'm now your Tuesday guy. I'm still Alex, you know, still the same, but I'm just on Tuesdays instead now. Um, sort of mix things up a bit now that Ryder's gone. Um, I hope I'll be less tired on Tuesdays, <laughs> so you'll get video better videos out of me. Um, this week's topic is sexuality and um, basically I will start to say is I do not agree with the labels um, that we have in society now. I don't see the point of them and I don't think it helps in terms of equality at all. Um, I would rather that there was a label for someone who likes women and someone who likes men. Um, like, you know, you're either femsexual or masksexual, or something like that. Because um, I don't see that there is anything to be gained by heterosexual and homosexual labels. Um, what, what really is the difference between a gay person and a straight person? The only difference is that I can possibly think of, and I was thinking about this in the shower, and you always have great thoughts in the shower, um, the only thing you can possibly think of is one can have children and one can't, but even then some straight couples can't have children, and so <laughs> that, that argument's flawed, and one can get married and one can't, but that's a socially constructed concept and it's based off this old book <laughs> that is millions of years old and I, I I can't get my head around the fact that people think there's a difference between a gay person and a straight person so there, to me there is really no need for those labels you either you like women, you like men, you like both, you like neither or some variation of that. Or, you know, you like people who aren't men or women, you know? Um, so really, that you know, there should be femsexual, masksexual, bisexual, pansexual, and all the rest of them that I can't remember. Asexual, demisexual, actually demisexual doesn't really count me. Um, as for my sexuality, I am attracted to women. Um, I've known that I've been attracted to women since I was 14. Was I 13? I think I was 13. Um, but I am also demisexual, I think. I don't really care, to be honest. <laughs> I, I don't give a fuck about my sexuality. Um, I have a girlfriend, that's all I need. If I break up with her any, at any time, not that I'm planning on doing so, um, then I'll take things as it comes, I won't go actively looking for a partner, um, I don't understand people who sort of do the whole rebound thing and then three weeks later there's someone else, I don't think it's a necessary part of life to have a partner, um, I could very easily leave a bachelor existence, um, I, I just think that if someone comes along then they come along and I will be happy with them, but I'm not going to go on dating websites looking for them. Um, I don't think that's natural. Um, but yeah. I think I'm demisexual. Um, I don't... If you don't know what demisexual is, it means that you aren't sexually attracted to someone on sight. Like, I don't ever see someone go past and think, fuck, they're hot. Um, whether this will change when I get on tea, I don't know, but um, I've never felt like that. I've only ever really fancied two people um, and thought they were attractive. One is now my girlfriend, the other was a um, 23 year old teacher at my school. Um, I'm not too sure whether that contributed in her getting fired. That was a strange time for me, but um, 
I don't think it did have anything to do with her getting fired, but sometimes I do worry that that was. Um, but yeah, I don't. I don't think sexual uh, sexuality is a big deal. I just think that we should be who we are and end up with who we end up with, and if they're not the people that we thought we would end up with one day, then just roll with it. If you're happy, it doesn't matter whether you know, they're male, female, cis, trans, um, like dogs or cats. It's just they're a person, and if you just click with them, then go for it, basically. Um, so yeah, I don't, I just, just be who you are and be with who you want to be and fuck all the labels. See ya.